Lord, this is Elder Ledoux coming to you, uh, coming to you from the book of Jeremiah, chapter 18, verses 1 through 6. The word which came to Jeremiah from the Lord, saying, Arise and go down to the potter's house, and there I will cause thee to hear my words. Then I went down to the potter's house, and behold, he wrought a work with the wheels. And the vessel that he made of clay was marred in the hand of the potter, so he made it again another vessel as seemed good to the potter to make it. Then the word of the Lord came to me saying, O house of Israel, cannot I do with you as the potter said the Lord? Behold, as the clay is in the potter's hand, so are ye in my hand, O house of Israel. Of course, what God is trying to tell us here in, this, in that scripture is that even though we're going through this epidemic or this, this little phase that God has taken us through to show us that we need to be obedient. He's also helping us to be strong by remaking us, refolding us, reshaping us with the potter's will. He wants us and our nation and the world, for that matter, to be reshaped. And that's what he's doing. The world will never be like it was before this pandemic. It's going to be a whole different world. And you'll see the differences. It's going to be a whole different thing. So in order for you to make it in this, you just got to do what God says and be obedient in him and just believe that he is reshaping you for the better. In God's name we pray. Amen.